Hey everybody, the Banga's back. Welcome to part 19 of Let's Play Bloodborne. Alright, I think it's high time we explore Forsaken Castle Kanehurst, but I'm wondering where exactly we have to explore. Do we go inside the castle itself through here? Well, I guess that's also part of the castle. It's just one big area. I was wondering what the hell I just heard. It's all the way back there. Like, okay, whatever. Unless I can warp light speed, I don't think I need to worry. Okay, I figured that would not work. I could go down there, or I can get over here. To get a frenzied cold blood. I knew I should have dressed warmer for this. I didn't think it would be this cold. <laughs> uh, can't really get away from the snow forever. There has to be at least one wintry area in most games. Even Mario. <laughs> oh look, there's a snake! How are you guys surviving out in the cold like this? Oh, this could be bad. Ooh, okay. Oh, you know what? They got large bellies. Makes it easy to get around them. So they look kind of intimidating, but they don't seem that bad. Alright, that's fine. Lots of snakes might be a pain in the ass, though. So. Especially that first hit, you just end up going over its body. So it's pretty easy to miss. We should get a bestiary in this game, because I really like to know- Whoa! Jesus Christ! We gotta go. <laughs> uh, I wish there was like a bestiary so I can understand the lore on each creature and stuff. And why exactly they came to be. And I wouldn't mind getting the nomenclature of each monster correct. It's like, that's what I liked about the, uh, like, Neo 1 and 2. At least you were able to get a bestiary as to what you were fighting. It was just a nice touch. And you learn a little bit of the, uh, folklore of each creature. Not very easy to do in a game like this when it's just a whole fictional world. And none of this is based on actual legend. Okay, there's actually a worse idea. And neither is the Tonitrus. Come on! Jesus Christ! Oh my god! Freaking snakes! They're the worst! How are there still so many of them? What am I getting here that's even worth all this trouble? A Tampering Blood Gemstone 3. God, that would just piss me off so much. This must be what I just got. Oh my god, that is really good. Look at that. Physical attack up 9.5%. Physical attack up near death. I mean, I like one of those effects. The second one kind of worries me. I mean, near death. I don't even know if you can most of the time get near death. Like, what if you're like 75% health and one hit is exactly 75%? Wow, this guy got aggroed all the way back there? He must have heard me yelling about the snakes. It's like, oh my god. This guy's such a bitch. Come on. Come on! What? How did the bullet miss? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, and it always gets away!
Okay. If I can get to the side, I can actually hit it more than once without it retreating. So those beasts are pretty irritating to fight against. It's a good thing I only fought- Whoa! Wow, can't believe I missed time to dodge. Are you kidding me? It adjusted mid-jump? Or mid-roll? And I'm dead. It's still trying to kill me. What the hell? Well, this is not a great start. I'm already got bodied by just basic enemies in here. Okay, well, at least I don't have to go down to the snake well again. Because that place was just frustrating AF. Okay, my echoes were only over here. Okay. Well, let me go get this first. Two numbing mist. That's the first time I picked up a numbing mist. Maybe I shouldn't even try to engage them. Like, how further did they even pursue, anyway? That far! <laughs> I just wanted to get that item over there, and it's gone. It was just suck- what was it sucking my blood after I died? I don't know if that's good for you. <laughs> I'm just gonna throw that out there. Clearly you've had enough. At least I'm not that far before I die, so that's a good thing. I need to get better at fighting these blood beasts. Like, they just look like absolute gluttons. More numbing mist! Did you just see that? That was 100% on a one combo! <laughs> 100% damage! In just like... Not even two seconds. <laughs> well, I picked up the other bit of numbing mist. What's the other item then? Holy shit! If this is what I gotta deal with the rest of the way, I may not even make it through Kaner's castle. At least not currently. More frenzied cold blood, it's alright, I guess. And I think I just- oh! Oh yeah, there's more. There's more things here. Better frenzied cold blood. More frenzy cold blood, Mr. Frodo. Let me in, let me in, let me in! Okay, we made it. I think the worst is over. Except for the frenzied screaming, I guess. You missed a spot. Well, at least it's nice and shiny around here on this floor. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where'd you come from? You're not welcome here, ghosty girl. Do they always appear in the same spots? Uh oh. Oh, wait, you can do viscerals on them. I didn't even know. I didn't think it could because it seemed like a ghost. Oh, this is a problem. There are more. Another one. Maybe I should just ignore them for now. And just explore the rest of the castle. Oh, hello. Hmm, this one doesn't seem as transparent. Wait. 
They're all gone? Yeah, I don't see any more of them. Or at least I discovered the cause of these damn ghosts. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! You just got here! Come on! That ain't fair! And now there's more! Do they keep respawning? Was that a good idea? Time will tell. They're easy to fight, but they can probably overwhelm you so fast. You just got here and already you're mid-swing. Give me some time to react, lady. Jeez. Just let a play a play. Yeah, I think they're just going to keep coming back no matter what. This is not a good place to be right now. Did I get everything around the bottom part of the foyer? I think so. Oh, oh. Hold on. There's another one of those minions. Do see a chest. Let me go open it. A writer polish? I wonder what that is. There's still more of them. Okay! Okay, I guess we'll just trade shots for a little while. Goddamn scum. Man? Hashtag hose mad. <laughs> I gotta find the source of all of them. Maybe there's something over here that I missed. A bloodstone chunk. Well, that that was worth the uh, worth the trip. Now I can finally start, you know, building my weapons to plus seven. I just need more of them first. Okay, I thought there was something I can interact with, but no. Nope. It's a lot more manageable now that there's just less of them. Yeah, I don't think they respawn. There's still some in this room. Was that a grab attack? Like, why'd you stab the floor? Like, those ladies were putting in so much work to get that scrubbed, and this is how you treat their, their work. You are just the scum of the earth. You really are. No respect for the hard-working servants of Kanehurst Castle. So they deserve to be destroyed. God, the sobbing is starting to get to me a little bit. Like, this is all I hear. I don't know if it's sobbing or taunting. Ooh, a noble dress. Should I wear that? What does the noble dress do? A finely tailored tailor Bordeaux dress worn by the nobles of the old bloodline that traces back to the forsaken castle of Kanehurst. It'll lower my stats, but what difference does it make? I don't know if I should wear it. The stat drop is just too much. 
So while I might look cool, I think I'm gonna pass. Ah, nice brisk view. Look at this. I don't know if I can see the rest of the yarn on this way. Can't really tell what's what. Alright, we'll just keep going. Yeah, this castle seems a lot more manageable once you make it inside the castle. Like, once you're outside dealing with those damn blood beasts, like, oh, I don't know. Not feeling this place. Fuck. Did I just hear something flying? There's a tower over here, too. Oh, hello, Gollum. What's up? Or should I say Smeagol? Are you more of a Gollum guy or a Smeagol guy? There's another one. Damn! It didn't die? How did it survive such a face plant onto the hard stone? How is that possible? Holy crap! Oh, and it drops bloodstone chunks! Holy crap, these must be enemies worth fighting. Okay, so if you shoot them, they're like on their backs. It's so easy to take out. Okay, I gotta remember that. I don't know how hard they hit, though. Song. Whoa! How bad is this gonna be? How bad is this gonna be? Okay, it's only two lots of damage. Okay, that's fine. I was gonna be worried it would be all my health. So I kinda like gargoyles, because I notice they have wings. Or almost like vampires. Then again, almost everything tries to drain your blood. So vampire might be a bit too generous a term. It's a very ominous hallway. Whoa, 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 whoa. Think you're so hot with a rapier, huh? Well, that certainly showed you. Thanks for the blood vials. <laughs> Okay, out of all the places I've visited, this actually seems like the nicest. Like, it really feels like you're in a castle. I wonder how much this predates the rest of Yarnum, though. Because I've always liked, like, these kinds of architecture that you see that resembles the Middle Ages to a degree. I don't know if I should go this way. Let me see if I can find the shortcut back to the beginning. It might be around here. Uh-oh. I don't like the looks of this. And they're both aggroed. Okay, we... What the hell? Apparently their scream could do a nice lot of damage to you. Whew. Didn't manage my stamina well, but I still survived. Executioner garb. Ah, is it any good? I uh, definitely don't want to wear that hunter hat. Thank you very much. I'm not a masochist. I don't know if I deal with Frenzy here, but you know what? 
I think we'll wear the Executioner garb. Maybe I should change gloves, too. Maybe the Yargle black gloves I'll go back to? And you know what? I haven't really changed my uh, boots in a while. They gotta be very uncomfortable by now. <laughs> Okay, you know what? I'll pass. So that's all I got. Just some attire. That's eh, alright, I guess. Still didn't find the, uh... The switch for the lift. Hope I didn't pass it or anything. Oh, wait, is this it? Device is currently inoperable. Oh, I need to step on the button. Duh. I was getting worried. Okay, now we're back here. Nice. That is just what I actually was hoping to do. Now let me see what's inside here. Vile blood register. What is a vile blood register? not any of this. Is it in here? A register listing all known vile bloods. Red leather record of vile bloods loyal to the covenant of Annalise, queen of the vile bloods at Canor's castle. Oh, it's online use only. Cannot use this item offline. Hmm. Weird that it'd be an item that's only for online use. Oh, hello, madam. Ow! Okay, maybe I shouldn't switch targets so much. Just saying, that might be an unwise decision. What the hell does that mark even do? When did I just get a mark on the back of my head? Am I debuffed? Okay, whatever it is, it's gone now. I mean, I kept myself out of danger, so it didn't get to affect me that much. Oh my god, there's still more? Still need to do some stuff around the library. What the? It's that scream again. It just did damage to me automatically. Oh, wait a minute, maybe the damage is coming from the stairs. If I get up there... Oh, wow. Maybe that's what it was the whole time. Just somebody holding a candelabra, chucking... Look, what looks like it could be knives? Who knows what that was? It was just freaking me the fuck out! I thought I was taking damage from that sigil on my back. Doesn't seem like that was the case at all. Um, Can't do anything with the books. Oh! Oh, I'm sorry, were you stuck? Don't worry, there's not gonna be many stairs where you're going in the end. Hail! Where you belong. Wait, wasn't there a treasure chest over here? 
thought there was a no I oh no wait it's this one Oh you can't destroy tables Wait a minute how do you What the hell how do you get to this one? Oh I I know what I need to do. I think I need to use this set of stairs. Then I can get over here. Open that up. Get the Evelyn. The Evelyn looks like it might be a gun. It's not a gun. Where's the Evelyn then? It's not even a weapon. Oh, and apparently I don't have enough uh, blood tinge to use the writer polish. What's the Evelyn? Could it be a special item? It's not a key item. It's not a weapon. It's not a gun. Oh wait, it is a gun! How come I didn't see that earlier? Oh, I know why. Blood Tinge is 18. Oh, that would be a really good gun, but I haven't been putting points in Blood Tinge. I may not be able to use that for a long time, unless I've been diverting all my stats to Blood Tinge. And I'm too far gone to even do that. Though it might be a good idea in the future if I ever want to switch guns. You know, just to change it up. You, you. How did you get a stab on me if you were already dead? What was hitting me? Oh! It's this asshole. Feel cute now? Chucking knives at me? In a place of reading? It just seems I was taking damage for this one guy. I know it's probably another dude with a knife. I didn't think there would be another one so soon. Oh, come on! From there? It kept going? Holy shit! It's got some accuracy! Also, it doesn't help that this place is so dark that I can't even see where the knives are going. Get out of here! Good riddance! Oh my god, I can actually walk out here? Why is that even an option? Oh, probably just to get one item over here. Eh, sure, I'll go for it. Excuse me? That was just for bullets? Are you mad, game? You, you make me go through all this trouble just for bullets? I can buy my bullets. Why must you be a shit ass? Wait, this is a whole different room! I thought I was already here! Remember this? And it looks like I just got past a gargoyle, too. Alright, this one's actually a little different. It was not holding a blade like the others were. What kind of weapon was it? 
Okay, that must be the screamer. Oh, I see another chest locked around tables. Oh, it locks you in place! Oh my god, it did it again! Get out! Get out! I'm dead. After all that, after all that, I still died. <laughs> oh, that's the worst, because I got stun locked twice, if not three times in a row. It just kept doing the same tactic, and I kept fell falling for it. Oh my god. Well, at least I'm only back here. Just wish I could have opened that chest. Wonder if there was another way to get into that room. But I think I might have to run past everything if I can. Don't know if it'll be easy to dodge all the gargoyles or even all the dudes with knives. That might be a difficult task. There's already one ass asshole with a knife now. Oh my god! Why am I even going this way? I'm just better off just ignoring them. Maybe there was like another room I could have visited rather than just use the window. Well, there's a ladder. Could I have used that from the start? I don't know. Thanks for the bloodstone chunk. Oh, hello. And goodbye. Thank you. Was I supposed to, like, go back down so I can climb the ladder? But wait, I can't reach the ladder over here, can I? There's another ladder. So I guess I have to reach the top and then I can get to the bottom again. I don't know if I have to use the window. So I'm just going to have to play it safe and ignore the windows and just move around. Yeah, maybe just go after the knife throwers only. The rest are of no consequence. Let's see what I can check out without going through a window. What the hell was that? Did something collapse? I don't know. It's freaking me out, though. Oh, more bullets. It's the thought that counts. Yeah, I don't think there's any other place for me to go. There's no other ladder that I can take. Was there another window I could have used? Surprisingly, no. And there's no ladder over here. It looks to be on the other side of the shelf. Is that true? Yeah, I don't see anywhere else to go. Yeah, I can't get down there. It looks like I gotta go through the window find the lever so I can activate that shortcut and then I don't have to go up here again. I think this was in the room that I got killed. Hope it didn't chase me all the way over here. That's how you be an absolute shit heel. Oh, 
Okay, I can deal with them fine. As long as they don't have a freaking screamer nearby, I can handle it. There's the other, that's one screamer. Got my echoes back. Okay. I don't know if this is the room that has a lever. Is that the other screamer? Did I get that one already? I, mean, I hope so. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the enemy. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's a knife chucker here. God damn it. I think I might be able to kill this one. What? No. Okay, there's nobody else there to threaten me other than a knife. Which hits me dead on, of course. Because I was still stunned. Fuck you. Get out of here, you damn chairs. Put me in a bad spot. Is there another, like, gremlin to worry about? No, I think it's safe. Okay, I can get this chest just fine. Okay. Price is averted in this room. Executioner's gloves! What kind of weapon is that? Is it a weapon? No, it might be something I need to wear here. Okay, it doesn't really do anything special. However, I wouldn't mind wearing it. Now, what are the reasons there to go this way other than just to get some treasure? Oh, hold on. There's still one of those ghouls alive. Okay, can we stop trading shots? Gimme. What is this? Knight's garb? With gloves, trousers, slash dress. That might be a little bit better. Offers less resistance to other things. So that's on the maybe pile. I guess it depends on what I'm up against. Whether I want to wear it or not. So is there really nothing else? There's no lever, there's no door, there's no stairs. Just, alright, you got what you came for. Get out. Oh, gargoyles, too. Can't forget about the gargoyles. Nothing to do with that awesome TV show that was around in the 90s called Gargoyles. Anyway. Let's just, uh, take what we need. Oh, you can get twin bloodstone shards here, too. How about that? I guess I gotta go, like, on this part of the roof. Oh, is that what I think it is? I think that's the lever I saw earlier. Aha! We open that up. We have ourselves a shortcut. That's what I'm uh, talking about. But wait. I thought there was a ladder that I could have grabbed. Is there no ladder? I 
I forgot that a scum lord was still waiting for me the whole time. Okay, that's fine and dandy and all, but I'm still kind of confuzzled where I need to go. Look. There's a ladder over here. Have I been near, near it this whole time? But it seems like I can't touch it. What is going on? Is my perspective kind of jank? Oh, there it is. It was like wedged right where the shortcut begins. What? Am I being picked off by knives? Oh my god, there's yet another treasure chest. If anything, this this area has been giving me lots of treasure. Warm blood gemstone. Okay, that's a new one. So where am I going? Through here? That might be the way to go. But it looks like there is other things to check out. And I've always been curious of what's around me. Just so I don't miss anything good. Keeping my eyes peeled for anybody that might jump me. That's what you gotta do in these kinds of games. Oh! Hello. Give me the goods. Two bloodstone chunks. I think my axe should be able to get to plus seven right now. Holy shit. Also, I didn't realize I'm recording for over 40 minutes. <laughs> Time flies when you're having fun, let me tell ya. I don't know how much longer this Let's Play is gonna be, because I mean, not only do I gotta go through the rest of the game, I gotta go through the DLC. And if it's anything like Dark Souls, I gotta do the DLC before I do the final boss. Otherwise, I just go straight to New Game Plus. Because that's how it worked in Dark Souls 1. Okay, am I near... Am I at the top of the castle already? No, it looks like there is a... Oh god, more gargoyles. Oh, that could have been my chance. That's okay, sound only travels in specific areas. Okay, this is starting to get a little annoying. Ah, oh, that one had to take the bullet, how dare you. It's like the bot. It's like that scene from The Simpsons where uh, James Woods took a bullet for a poo. It's like no. Okay, I think we got through the worst of this. Thank God, there's a wide open space to deal with three gargoyles. <laughs> a knight's wig. Um, doesn't offer much defense, except for, like, poison. That might look tacky on me. Wait, where do I drop now? Over here? I don't see anywhere else to go. I mean, at least I can go back to the stairwell in case it's wrong. I think they want me to get on this part of the roof. Let me look what's around all the way. Okay, nothing there. Whew. Thank God I don't have a fear of heights, am I right? Can you imagine going to a place like this and you get dizzy from like tall heights? That'd be like the shortest run ever. Like, this would just be a brick wall. 
Hope we find another shortcut, because this seems like a very long trek. Even with the shortcuts we've already found. So we must be getting to the top of this tower, too. I wonder what's waiting for me. It's another roof. The roof. The roof. The roof is on fire, except this is... There's only a small bit of fire right there. <laughs> That's not much of a fire. That's just a, a heat source. Or, or not a heat source, a light source. And nothing else. Okay, that was just a messenger. Nothing to do with that uh, awesome video game, The Messenger. Hopefully get like another DLC, because I found that, uh, what, Pirate Panic, or whatever it's called, or Picnic Panic, a bit short. Cutscene. I don't think I'm welcome here. Look at that! Look at that crown. Uh, have you ever gotten a manicure in like ever? <laughs> or a haircut? Yeah, no wonder you're cranky. Your throne room's outside. I'd be cranky too. Martyr Lagarius. Oh, what is this? Whatever it is, it can shoot through the pillars. Okay, so I can use the Rufus cover. And I could roll through them. So that's very helpful. Come on over. Ow. Okay, so you can visceral. Got a long weapon, too. Oh, no, no, no! They really love to throw in a boss battle on a roof that you can fall off at any given time. <laughs> Had to stoop be with Dark Souls of the freaking Belfry Gargoyles. And now it's this one. Well, that was a lot of blood echoes that I lost. Unless I can make it back to the boss battle. But I'll do that in the next episode, alright? See you later, everyone. Thanks for watching.